Hello guys, welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to buy options in DGRO. So firstly you want to do is you want to open up the web browser of DGRO. You can go to trader.dgero.nl and once you're over here you have your stocks from the AEX. Mind you that you're only allowed to trade uh, options in Dutch stocks and European stocks. Um, unfortunately, you can't do this for American stocks. So you have your stocks over here. You can go to AEX or AMX or one of them. Um, I usually trade the AEX. So uh, let's go and click on Royal Dutch Shell, which is um, a Dutch company. I believe it's a market cap of 100 billion plus. So here's the premiums are quite low. So then you have to click on Opsies. Uh, I have my settings in Dutch, but you have probably the option to change it to English as well. Um, moreover, you have your strike prices over here <laughs> and here are your dates. And obviously this is just one week away from here, 17th of December. Um, but on the bottom left, you can see this control tab and you can go, I believe eight pages away. So here you have your date. Um, you can even go to 2024 call options, which is pretty sick. So currently, um, shell is, let's say trading at 19.76. Um, if you wanted to buy a call option, uh, let's say, for example, you want to buy the 20 strike price. Here you can see the premium, which is the bid price of 250 euros, so 2.55 euros. And this is currently the bid price. Um, normally, during the market when it's open, this updates quite well. But since I'm trading right now offline and the market's obviously not open right now, these aren't really updating. So let's say we click on the um, uh, strike price of 20 for four years uh, away, so three years away, which is a um, call option and it's a leap call option. So you click on 250 and you can see the chart of how this call option has been trading. Obviously with this new Corona variant, um, last week it went to 1.83 and is up 50% this call option. And there was some s like scarcity, I guess, with this new variant of COVID. And I, I believe Shell fell like 8% one day. So you can see it went to 1.83 and six months, it's doing quite okay. So how do you exactly buy this? So you have to click on GOPE. And once you click on GOPE, you have to do limit order. So let's say you, you wanna buy it for 2.47, whatever the price is then. So you do 2.47, you type it in with a comma over here and in your phone, you do it also with a comma. And let's say you wanna buy one. So now when you wanna buy one, if you know an option contract comes with uh, within a hundred contracts, so this contract would cost you two hundred forty seven euros plus eighty five cents commission. So then you all you have to do is do Platt's order and here okay it's actually two hundred forty seven um, yeah eighty five cents commission and then you have to do bevestig okay um, I'm gonna do a new like I'm gonna say no to this right now but let's say you're bearish on the stock and you think you want to hedge your position. Let's say you have a huge stock position in the stock and you want to hedge this position just in case shell, sell, shell stays below $20. And then you'll be able to get this $247. Um, but your upside is limited uh, within your stock because if it goes above 20 point, uh, 22.47, you're going to start losing money. So the same way it works with for cope, you do the 2.47 and you do one and then you do Platt's order. So this is actually called a covered call. Um, but covered calls are, are usually like a shorter date. This is obviously three years away. So I wouldn't recommend this, but in the short term, you can always go a bit closer. Um, uh, let's say um, to January or February with a 20 call in which you'll receive $1 in premium. So Shell is a stock that doesn't move as much. And if it stays under 20, this will be worth zero and you'll be able to keep the $1. So that was basically it for this video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time.